Country music challenge. Let's see how many y'all could tell what real country music is. Song, song of the South. Sweet potato pie and I shut my mouth. Every light in the house is on the backyard's bright as a crack of dawn. The preacher man says it's the end of time and the Mississippi River, she's a gold dry. There are three wooden crosses on the right side of the highway. Mamas, don't let your babies grow up to be cowboys. We'll have a half party we don't need. And partner, there's a tiger in these tight-fitting jeans. Okay, I got a question. How do you consider yourself a true country fan and not know any of those songs that we're just playing? Now, I'm sure 75 to 80% of the people that are watching this probably know the Sam Hunt song I was playing because that's been overplayed nonstop for the past four or five years now since it's been out. But seriously, man. You know, I was more of a rap fan and a rock fan growing up than I was a country fan. Obviously, I, I like country a hell of a lot more now. You know, both old and some of the new stuff that they come out with. But I swear, the younger generation of people out there have no idea what real country actually is. You know, anytime I was around my mom growing up, if she wasn't listening to people like DMX or Tupac or old school Eminem or old school Nelly or any of them, she'd be listening to country all the time. You know, and country artists like Garth Brooks, Shania Twain, you know, Big and Rich, you know, all of them, and even some of the older people. Older artists, I should say, like Willie Nelson, Johnny Cash, and all of them. You know, she was real big in the old country growing up. And if I was around her, that's what I would listen to. Obviously, growing up, I wasn't a fan of it. But now, looking at it now, listening to that music brings me back so many memories. Like I said, man... People around my age, or maybe a little younger or a little older, which I'm 24, by the way, almost to be 25 in three months. <sighs> Some people just need to listen to some of the older music and get used to it to know what they're getting into. I'll say that right now. Now look, everybody has their own taste of music, which is alright, you know. Like I said, I listen to just about anything, you know. I grew up liking rap music and rock music, and then, you know, as I've gotten older, you know, I've started liking country more and more, and, you know, I also listen to Christian music and, you know, just all sorts of music out there, you know. As long as it's not, like, mumble rap that they play on the radio non-stop nowadays or if it's like country pop like Dan and Shay or any of them then you know I'm all right with it you know nothing wrong with it in my opinion with that being said you know there are certain newer country artists or artists that claim to be country that I think are all right don't get me wrong about that yeah, I'm not throwing all of them under the bus, but a lot of the newer artists nowadays that claim to be country sound more like pop than they do country. And I'm pretty sure that that's what these people in that video probably listen to. I'll put that out there. <laughs> 